Hi again, YouTubers. So this is my July favorites, five favorites and one regret. And I'm going to add one extra thing in there. So it's going to be five favorites and one continued love that I just want to mention again. Um, first thing that I am really, really loving was sent to me by Lola Marie Seven. And it is the leave-in treatment of natural argan oil and this is what the packaging looks like um it is a leave-in treatment but i love just after i get out of the shower i put it on my ends and it makes my ends feel amazing like my hair just feels so good after using this and it's a huge bottle um but i love it i absolutely love it um i've used moroccan argan oil before on my face and on my hair and things like that but this one i'm really really enjoying this i use it i've literally used probably quarter of the bottle I would say but I'm absolutely loving that so that is a great product another thing that I am loving is my Milani liquid liquify eye metallic eyeliner pencil in black these are great they just work so great for me I have my waterline lined with them right now um, the downside of them is you do have they're really soft and you do have to sharpen them a lot but the other side is is they're not that expensive so um, it's not too bad to repurchase. So I've had this one for a while and I mean, I'm probably about halfway through it. Um, black, I have black, brown. I just have black and brown. Um, there is a silver and somebody told me a gold and somebody also told me, or a bunch of people told me on my uh, video that these can be found also at Target. I haven't seen them at mine, but um, some people say that you can find it there. The next thing I'm loving this month that I've been using for the entire month and I just did a review on it is a product line called Jewel Therapy. Um, you can buy it at beautychoice.com and it's four steps and I'm really liking the results I'm getting on my skin. It's really easy, it's not overdone, it's not you know eight or nine steps. Uh, it's just a simple four step uh, process and it works really well, I seem to be liking it. Um, the next thing, I know I'm running through these kind of quickly, um, but I wanna kind of do some updates afterwards too is, um, the next thing that I'm loving, and I should have left Charming Cat. There we go. Uh, it is a fiber mascara. Oops, I pulled out the wrong one. Where's the right one? Maybe I did. Maybe I didn't. Sorry, my mascaras are in here. There it is. Found it. Sorry. Um, it is the Charming Gel Fiber Mascara, and it's the fibers and the... Um, mascara and I'm just loving it. I don't have it on right now, but I'm absolutely loving it. Uh, next thing I am loving is um, this was from Skincare RX, and I'm, I have a review coming up on this. It's a personal home microdermabrasion, and I used it after I went for a professional one, so I can give you guys uh, some insight as to how it works versus a professional one, but I'm loving it. I think it's a great, great thing. Um, my last thing that I'm loving, this is my bonus item, is I still use this. I go back to it religiously, and I don't have it on today, but uh, when I was on vacation last week, I use it every single day, and it's my Shiseido Sun Protection Liquid Foundation, very water resistant with sunscreen of SPF 42. Love this stuff. Love it, love it, love it. I used it every day on vacation, could not do without it. It is amazing. So now on to my regret. And this isn't really a true regret regret because I didn't buy much in July, um, but I'm not as impressed with it as I thought I was gonna be. Everybody was raving about this. It is the Maybelline Dream Smooth Mousse Foundation. This is what it looks like. I had it in the, I have it, had it. Have it in the color. 240 natural beige it's an okay product but if you have combination oily skin my lights are making things look really orange but um, if you have combination oily skin I don't know it didn't work for me it didn't stay I had to like continuously blot and it kind of looked oily through the day it was okay I wouldn't repurchase it but um, I wanted to try because everybody was talking about it so that is my regret, my five favorites, my one bonus item, and my one regret. Now, a few things is I was away on vacation at the end of July. I'm going away again in August. So if there's been a delay in responding to your comments, I'm so sorry, but that is why I'm behind. Um, I still post videos while I'm gone, but I don't necessarily have time to respond to comments. 
Uh, next part is, is I kind of moved things around again. Um, I'm back to just having the brick wall behind me instead of the half and half uh, because I moved some things on my vanity. And um, I have a lot of reviews coming up. I've been super busy with work. Um, if you guys follow me on Twitter, I have been crazy busy with work, which is surprising because usually the summer isn't very busy. Um, for those of you wondering, I do real estate, um, but I have been super, super busy lately, which I'm loving. I'm absolutely loving it. I love being busy, but it's kind of hindered my posting my videos and things like that. So I am just apologizing for that. And thank you to all my new subscribers and all my old ones. Um, I love seeing your comments. I read every single comment and I respond back to anyone that has a question um, for the most part. Like, it might take me a little bit, but I get back to it. So um, I hope you guys enjoyed my July favorites and my one regret and my extra bonus one. If you have any additional questions on anything you saw here, definitely post a comment below. Um, I already have a review up on the jewel therapy and I have a review from last year on this um, the other things I will do reviews on I do have a review coming up on this very very soon so please let me know if you have any questions I hope you guys enjoyed this and thanks for watching bye